M0FXV, welcome back to my TK11 videos. Big shout out to Ernie from CQ UK for making me this stand. And if you want the same one, I'll put the link in the description. And uh, very reasonably priced there, raising money for CQ UK, which as we know is a fa fantastic link for ham radio. So today we're going to talk scanning. If you hold down your star button, you know, we've got the, the 8 model here, and this is the 5 model, okay? If you hold down the star, it will start to scan in whichever band you happen to be in. So let's just hold down the star. Oops. Cancel. Just hold a bit longer. Scanning begin. It starts to scan. It's actually quite fast, I think. I think that's a very reasonable speed there. Now, we can set these parameters. They're all preset, and there's about eight of them. Uh, they're all set to your band. So if you go through the bands with the band button here. And if you start scanning, say for example, we're in the 650 band there. And we hold down the star. Scanning begin. It starts to scan. And then exit to stop. Scanning stop. Pretty sure you can press the PTT as well. So how do we change these parameters? Well, all you do is go menu. Menu. And keep going right and left with the arrows until you see VFO scan, then press menu. So now as you cycle through, look for the F button, so F6 and F5, F, F4, 3, look 76, F6 was the 2 meter band. Uh, it's actually 136, to, I, I said it's 150, so all you do when you want to change it, press the menu and, and Yes, it has timed out. Uh, so we'll do that again. Menu. menu, back in, menu. Then go into F6. And to change between the start and the end frequency, you press the right arrow. Okay, you have to press it again. Confirm. Then you do right, it says end. Okay. So let's just say we want to change the beginning there. Press menu. And then we're going to type in one similar. So we'll go one, one three. three. Five. You do need to add all the noughts or whatever you're going to do and then confirm, okay? So we do that again. Start, we'll go menu. One, three, five, zero, zero, zero. Uh, it probably has a limit to what you can do on that band. Uh, so let's do, oh no, let's put the nearest thing to it and then we go menu. Push to the right, oh, go again, time out. Menu. Let's do the end one. So, confirm. End. Press it, and then we're going to go one, one five, five, one. one. Oh, I'm faffing a bit. Zero, zero, zero. Confirm. Make sure you confirm. Exit. Cancel. Cancel. So now, if we change, look at the F here. It says F11. So we press the band until it says six. We're now going to scan, hold down the scan. Begin. And it scans, and then you can end. Scanning stop. What I have noticed, if you press the 7 to get the scope up, that hasn't been changed, I noticed. So I think there's a whole new learning to how we do it on, you know, when we're using, when we're using the, 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 um, the scope. But that's another video. Bye for now.